everybody, my name is Laura Hunter. I'm the CEO of Tori Bell Cosmetics and today we are going to watch The Face Off from Glow Up Season 4, Episode 2. All right, here we go. Push the bravery, the lion in me is gonna come strong and show the judges what I can do. I love the twin thing, you guys. The MUAs will face off over a pair of identical twins and we'll be tackling a red hot makeup trend. One of them has her nose pierced, the other doesn't. Made lip that glimmers with a metallic aqua finish. Oh, mermaid lip with aqua. Start by taking the teal and the pink lip colors and apply them to different areas of the lip. Subtly blend those colors together with a brush where they meet. Press varied glitter colors to the lip till the lip is completely covered. I can't say this is my favorite look, but Really what's gonna be difficult here is not blending the colors together on accident and getting the glitter on so it looks like sand instead of just chunks. You both have 15 minutes to complete your look. The best of luck. Now they're back to 15 again. Although this is a little harder. Hmm. So it's interesting, they each seem to be doing one color top and one color bottom. We didn't ask for one color on the top and one color on the bottom. It's interesting because when they said two color lips, obviously they both misunderstood and thought that they meant, you know, top, bottom, different or side to side different. But it's interesting because they both seem to also be doing an ombre between the two colors. So I'm very curious how this is going to turn out. Because I feel like I should whisper to in the blue pencil <laughs> or the pink ah, pencil. This is so interesting. Then they could have gone in with their color. Both lips are going to look unbalanced. 30 seconds to go. This is a very interesting thing. I don't think either of them actually know what a mermaid lip is, so hence we have a problem. Okay, wait, did you see that? He was using tape to clean up the line, and it wasn't on there before. That's, I'm gonna have to try that. That is an interesting hack, and I've never seen it before. I thought I'd seen everything. Five, four, three, two, one. Brushes down, please. Oh, oh my gosh, and they're opposite. This is so interesting. Wow. Personal preference. Oh, I think we need a corn flab. Let's have a corn flab. My personal preference is the pink on the bottom and the blue on the top because I think that the other one makes her upper lip look very large by comparison to her lower lip. So it's, it's not particularly even and it, it's just not, um, it's not flattering. Also, I think he went a little bit too far outside the lip line. Um, so that's my personal preference, but they did basically the exact same thing. So it's going to come down to, I'm gonna guess, um, which is more attractive, which is always important, and which is done technically better. So, you know, is the ombre good? Does it have the right amount of glitter on it? Um, and definitely are the lines clean and symmetrical. Let's see, see how the conflab goes. This is a tough age. They're always so nice to each other on these British shows straight in with the blue. He was able to create a lot more richness. Yeah. Which gives me that warm mermaid effect. It's almost there, but it's a bit untidy. Mm. Both of them have struggled and given a slightly fuller upper lip. Right, the upper lip, a little unsymmetrical. Because Rachel's gone for the pink upper lip, it looks brighter and lighter, mm. and it gives a more metallic finish overall. You can really see the glimmer when yeah. you move the face. Mm. I think we've made our decision. I think we have as well. I think they're going to pick Rachel, but I prefer Adam. Let's see. Have you made your decision? We have. I also like her shirt a lot. It you looks... Strong, wait, wait. When they show it again... Rachel. Look at... She almost has a quad logo on her shirt. I love that. I loved your use of colour and your blending was impressive. Adam, your lip lacks symmetry and you didn't give us the seamless blend, which resulted in a two-toned lip. Adam, please pack your kit. You're gonna go home. I can't say I agree. I actually think that Adam's was more symmetrical because it wasn't so heavy and bright on top, but to each their own. I'm feeling gutted, obviously, because my journey has come to an end, but what a beautiful journey it's been. Oh, it's so cute. I took that leap of faith. I got here. This is where my journey has not ended. It's just starting. That is an absolutely fabulous message. <laughs> I'm very happy right now. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching some Glow Up with me, and we will do this again with the next episode.